So there's the stock cars. Let's see how these go. Could be some fun and games. Off they go. Now Jeff Roberts in the number one car at the back of the field is not mobile. Now he is. It's a very slow start for him. And the other number one up the front of the field, Wayne Phillips, has gone to the lead. Now these cars will be able to, oh, there's a bonnet flown up over there, the 69 car. down main straight away the number one car of uh, Phillips is the leader followed by the three of West the four of Morris and the 30 car this is event 11 and the leader is the black number one of Wayne Phillips in second place is the number three car of Steve West, then the 30 car of Terry Moore, and the four car of Gary Morris. Race leader is the black number one car. Coming down past our control tower now, he leads out from the number three of Steve West, who's in second place. The number four of Gary Morris is running third. The 99 of Walton is fourth. And the blue 49 car of Gordon Patton was in fifth place. Got a collision with the 38 car of Elliott. Ran straight into the concrete wall in turn two. Still the black number one of Wayne Phillips is the leader. In second place, the number three car, the white number three of Steve West. And in third place, the white number four, the similar coloured car, Gary Morris. In fourth place, the number 99 car of Peter Walton. And in fifth place, the number 38 car of Mark Elliott. Well, maybe they might be able to uh, stir up the surface of the track enough. The number one car of uh, Phillips is still the leader. The number three of Steve West, very high up on the track. Still the number one car of Phillips. He's coming into the northern corner, has the lead. Coming past us now, the number one, Phillips the leader. From the number three car of Steve West, he's in second place. And the number four car of Gary Morris is running third. And the So the chequered flag coming out and it will fall in the stock car grand slam for the New South Wales number one of, no, I think it might have been the three of Steve West who might have got up there just in time to cut the number one out of first place. And then the number four of Gary Morris. And I'll just check that with the uh, lap scorers to see whether that's the way they saw it as well.